If I could save time in a bottle The first thing that I'd like to do Is to save every day Till eternity passes away Just to spend them with you If I could make days last The skins have been split, the stems have been taken out And then we actually ferment in these uh, in these containers here Okay. Thank you. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Way up in the way up there. Licensed and bonded and yes. inspected. It's the Asian cabinet. The small little AC unit on this side. I looked around. Okay, it's time for you to tell me your the story. Now, when we left here, all this wine was being put into these uh, these these uh, glass. Carboys. Carboys with the valves on them, and how long have they they sat in the? Well, the the Syrah's been in. It's well that we 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 pressed the Syrah three uh, years ago. So okay, well that's that that's not the one that. Uh, no, that's, no, that's okay. you guys saw ten Cabernet, the one that's up uh, right. So yeah, yeah, yeah. so so the Syrah. This is a blend, huh? This is a blend of a. Of a slightly over oaked Syrah from 2008, and uh, the 2010 Cabernet has not seen any oak at all. It's all. Okay. And the, <laughs> the 2010 Cabernet is the one we saw, it's in the first film, and the one we saw. Right. And it's yeah. all been sitting here in glass because you didn't yeah, want it to get any more oak, uh, <laughs> any more oak flavor. Well, the, the 10 there Cab never go. went in the barrel at all. That never saw. Uh, we're gonna get glasses for everybody. Now, like the, the Syrah was in the barrel for a long time. About 15 months. And it got it got more oaky than you wanted. Exactly. And the, they were newer barrels. And the, the newer the barrel, the more flavor they impart. And so, <clears throat> by blending them, you'll try to get rid of the over oaky. I think we did. Yeah, it's, oh, and, and, it's perfect. Well, aren't you gonna let me have a taste? Yeah. yeah. This is delicious. I mean, I am the humble cameraman. But. <laughs> so, so the the Syrah. Was pretty, that was just a lot of a lot of sugar to make a lot of alcohol. Yeah. So Tim said it was it was uh, it was almost like raisins, huh? It was almost like raisins. You can taste it almost it, it, without it having that whole they have a camp for flavor. Too. And that's why it has the high alcohol so content. That's right. And wh what are we doing here? We're filtering. And how does that happen? We're just running uh, running the wine uh, out of the carboys through a, a three stage filter and. Uh, up into our mixing vessel. And then they start off nice and pristine. Oh, that's the that's the unused filter, that's huh? Mm -hmm. Alright. Okay, this is the filter, what it looks like before you get cleaned out, so just been used. <laughs> and that, now, that was done by experimenting? You, you had different... Yeah, it's a very scientific uh, yeah, procedure that we went through. A lot of effort. So... <laughs> What a I, lot of drinking. I mean, you well, have to try all. The what I wanted to know is uh, where where's the lab? The lab. I don't see the lab. There is. No You're lab. in the lab. Yeah. She I mean, passed away a couple years ago. All right. <laughs> so so you um you you, you, you try on error right and and you till you get it and you say mm -hmm. this is it. Hooray, we've we got it. Right? So it's even older Cabernet here from 2005. That we're going to go, it got a little over oak too, that we're going to go one to one. So oh. 2010 Cabernet with 2005 Cabernet I don't think that's at, a, at a one to one. Now have you got a, a name for your for your blend? I know that a lot of wineries have, have names. I don't think it's What you need to do is get a branding consultant. Okay. The job, t you're the corker? I am the corker. Okay. Good, yeah. Have you ever been called that before? <laughs> no, it's the shrink wrap gun that will heat and melt the little foil caps. They're not really foil. These are more like a plastic with just a foil top. So, Tim, how did you guys decide to do this? Uh, Tim's father is an alcoholic. <laughs> <laughs> So it was more out of necessity than uh, yeah, uh, any kind of creative. Action, action. What, what kind of food do you think will pair with this wine? Hit the switch. Yes, master. What's your plan? <laughs> I don't know, but it's 
got to be something that's going to have some... Uh, I'd go straight for the red meat, or even game, for the Syrah. The Syrah is really dominant. If I could save time in a bottle, the first thing that I'd like to do is to save every day. Till eternity passes away Just to spend